Hi guys, it's me, Sharon, and welcome back to my channel. Today on Creative Glam, I'm going to share with you my winter centerpieces. The theme of these centerpieces is pine cones and candles. I'm going to do one for my dining room table, and I'm going to do the other for my kitchen table. So let's get into it. Okay, let's get started. I decided to use some of the floral foam inside of my basket. And because my I didn't want to fill the entire thing with floral foam, I thought that I would use the floral foam and then use some paper as filler to kind of keep the floral foam where I want it to be. I don't want to do anything permanent because I am going to take this apart and reuse these items. So I'm trying to keep them as non-permanent as possible. Wrap my branches around the pedestal, which kind of anchors it and keeps it from moving around kind of makes it a little stationary for me, which is what I want. Um, I'm gonna tuck that under just like that. As I said, I'm trying to make this as non-permanent, beautiful but non-permanent um, as possible. This is gonna sit, this large one here is gonna sit on the dining room table. So, I, I was going to just fill the whole basket with paper, but I changed my mind because I had that bar that's running down the center of the basket and the candle wouldn't sit properly. So I had to use the floral foam that goes across the middle that gives me the height that kind of fills the basket without making it permanent. At least I hope it, it might be a little too tall. So I might end up changing this out because it seems like it's sitting a little higher than what I'd really want it to sit. Okay, I think that's it guys. I'm liking the way that looks. I'm liking the way that looks quite a bit. It looks very lovely. This larger one will sit on the table in the dining room and I'm going to make two smaller ones that will stay here on the kitchen table. I'm going to take these red bows off because they don't go with my decor.
actually, I have saved some of the flocked ones to put in here, but these seem so big. I don't know if they're going to work. Pine cones. This is coming along great. It's coming along great. Just to cover up some of the branches, just kind of filling in, and that's what I'm doing now. These are super simple. I mean, super simple. guys these are the two smaller centerpieces for the kitchen table it's all complete pine cones and candles that's the theme this year that I'm going for I didn't want too much but just enough for a winter tablescape I think it's beautiful and there's the centerpiece for the dining room table I'm going to add the other seating so you can see it complete I'm trying to decide whether I want to add the twinkle lights to it or not. I kind of do and I kind of don't. I'm just not sure. I like the way it turned out. I think it's really pretty. I tried to keep this as unpermanent as possible because I will be using the greeneries, the candles, and the baskets in another tablescape. So again, I just put styrofoam in the bottom and then I, around the styrofoam I placed balls of uh, bundles of paper newspaper I bundled newspaper around the styrofoam in the bottom just to give it height and to fill in the basket and then I put my greeneries on top put my candles in the center filled it in with berries and pine cones and I think it's absolutely beautiful some of the pine cones are natural just natural pine cones and some are flocked white and some are flocked with silver glitter but I think that turned out really pretty I like that and it's just enough. It's not too much. It's not too little. It still gives you the holiday feel. Pine cones and candles with a sprinkle of berries. I think that turned out really pretty. I like the way that looks. Thank you all for tuning in. I hope you enjoyed my DIY project. Don't forget to subscribe, like, and comment. And on that note, have a blessed day, and I'll see you next time. Bye!